Hi there, this is a quick video tutorial to show you how to use the um, CTrader SAR chart um, sync zoom indicator. So this was created by Spotware um, and it gives you the ability to actually zoom on one chart and any other charts you have open, it will zoom those at the same time. So it saves you having to go to each chart and individually zoom in. I'll demonstrate that now, uh, but this is the product page where you can download it. It comes complete with source code. It was created by the Spotware team um, and we're just allowing people to find out more information about how to use it and download it from our website at clickalgo.com. So I'm going to go to a chart now on CTrader. So this is the charts laid out in this view here. Um, I'm going to, I put four charts on the, on the screen here, 15 minutes, one hour, four hours and one daily or daily. Um, what I'm going to do is put them, um, group them in multi-chart mode so you can see all the charts together on here. Now this isn't a big monitor, this is a 1920 monitor I'm going to do the demonstration in because um, it's best for YouTube videos. But to, to use this indicator you need to actually attach it to each individual chart that you want to use. So on this chart here I have to tap the keyboard, type in the word zoom and it will come up as synchronized zoom. Now again I'm assuming that you've downloaded the indicator from our website, um, unzipped it and installed it into CTrader just by double clicking on the file. Once it's installed you can put it onto a chart this way. So I open it there and it shows me the mode I'm going to use. I'm going to click leave it at all at the moment. There's three modes, time frame and symbol, and I'll try and explain those in a minute. So now I want to do that to the next chart because it's already got zoom written in there. It will remember it. I'm adding them to each and individual chart. Okay. Now I've got the indicator attached to all the charts that I want to use. If I go to any chart and I zoom, I can zoom by doing control and scrolling the mouse. You can see that all the other charts actually zoom as well. Um, you can also zoom up here with the plus and minus, but I, f I find the uh, holding the control key down on the keyboard and if you've got a roller mouse, you can just roll it to zoom in and out. Okay, so that's that. What you can do now is I'll show you the settings. So if you want to get to your indicator settings, um, you need to do it on the chart that you want to use. So if I want to only um, do it so that when I'm adjusting this chart, the others take effect, um, you need to edit the indicator settings. There's a couple of ways of doing it. One is to control I. That opens up the indicator settings. You can also right click on the tree, uh, screen. This is a long way of doing it. Go into object manager and go into indicators. Find that a very long way of doing it. There's also up here, you've got indicators here, but the control I shortcut is probably the best way to do it. So once you're in here now, you can say mode time frame. You choose time frame. It will only zoom in on the charts that have the same time frame. If you choose symbol, it will only zoom on the charts that have the same symbol. So it gives you a little bit of flexibility to do that. Um, and then you've got them on your chart. Now, if you wanted to remove them from your chart, you don't want them to zoom anymore, then you just right click your, sorry, you do control I again on each chart, probably the quickest way, and just delete the indicator there. The indi indicator's gone. Click on the next chart, control I, remove. You can also do control I, um, and if you've got other indicators you want to remove, just do remove all indicators. Okay, that's it. It's pretty straightforward. I'm just removing the last one. And it's gone. So that's the Spotware um, product that you can download, or it's an indicator. So you can download it from our website at clickalgo.com. If you can't find it, just type in Zoom at the top and it will come up here, or you can just search for it. And once you've got the product, you just buy now, go through the process. You don't pay for it, obviously, it's free. And it comes with free source code, uh, the source code because it's open source. And if you've got any problems or questions, just post on our forum or send us a message in our Telegram chat group. Okay, that's the video. If you do like it, please give me a thumbs up. Thank you very much.